Hey guys, we're still here talking about complement activation. The last pathway we're going to talk about is the lectin, the lectin pathway. So in your body, you have things called lectins. Those combine to carbohydrates containing mannose on the surface of microbes. When they do, that will cause activation of C2 and C4, just like we saw in the classical pathway. Activation of C2 and C4 means C2 and C4 are chopped in half. When C2 and C4 are chopped in half, the C2A and the C4B combine together and that will activate serum complement protein C3, which will then lead to our outcomes that we're going to talk about in one of our next videos. So the three complement activation types that we talked about were classical, alternative, and lectin. Classical involved antibodies and the C1 protein. Alternative involved the B, D, and P proteins. And the lectin pathway, well, it involves lectin. So we'll see you guys in the outcomes video.